reason I'm doing this is to introduce to Grand Rapids uh, an alternate to uh, provide hyperlocal uh, access to good food. And I think what a lot of people don't understand is exactly how hydroponics works. Uh, in this demonstration, this is soilless. Uh, we control every aspect of the environment from the temperature to the lighting, the, the CO2 levels and so on and so forth. And uh, if you think about it, there's a lot of science, technology, engineering, and math, and it's just not biology of how you grow food, but actually of how you create the environment. You can grow quite a variety of things. In this container, I'm probably growing at this time about 12 different species of kales, shards, uh, butterheads, bibs, pop choy, tot soy. Uh, the second container is a uh, warmer environment, a more human environment, and inside it will be the basils, chives, oreganos, because they tend to like a warmer environment. Uh, you can, it is possible through hydroponics, to grow strawberries, uh, peppers, and of course uh, there are uh, in horizontal systems uh, tomatoes, cucumbers, that's one of the benefits of indoor ag, is that the variability of the climate what Mother Nature brings to us uh, is so controlled that uh, you always provide an optimum grow range for the product, so it is consistent from harvest to harvest. 